Hey guys, my name is Shari. I'm an English teacher. I live in Vancouver, Canada. I moved to Canada about two years ago. And today we're going to be working on some cool expressions. Are you ready? Let's get started. Expression number one, the ball is in your court. What does it mean? It is up to you to make the next move or it is time for someone to deal with a problem or make a decision because other people have already done as much as they can. Expression number two, bark up the wrong tree, pursuing the wrong thing on path or waste one's efforts by pursuing the wrong thing or path. Look at this example. If you think I can make more money, you're barking the wrong tree. Expression number three, blindsided. Blindsided? Yes, somehow like that. Means to surprise someone by harmful results, by something which is not very pleasant. Like, I think she is obviously blindsided because she can't see what her boyfriend is doing to her. So when you say I'm blindsided, means that you're surprised by something bad. You didn't know that. You're totally blindsided, right? You had zero clue. You didn't know about something. Next expression is call the shots. Hello, hi. No, it's not like that. So call the shots means be in charge, be in control. Like in my office, in my company, our boss calls the shots. What about you? In your house, who calls the shots? Or in your office, who calls the shots? Next one is get into the full swing. Get into the full swing means at the stage where the level of activity is at its highest. Like we got to a party, when we got there, the party was in full swing or the economic recovery is now in full swing. Next one, get a second wind. First wind, second wind. What does it mean? Get a second wind means to regain your energy back. Like I have to take some rest to make more videos for you guys. I should take a second wind. But I'm not allowed to because I have to keep going, right? So get a second wind. Go to bat for someone. Go to bat for someone means to support someone, to help someone, right? Have the upper hand. Have the upper hand means have the advantage over someone or something. He usually has the upper hand because he's older. What about you guys? In your house, in your office in your workplace who has the upper hand hit the snack hitting a snack means face a problem or have a problem i wanted to move to canada but then i hit a snack i faced with a problem i hope you won't hit a snack in your life to learn the ropes to learn the ropes means to learn skills if you're learning the ropes you are learning how a particular job or task is done I will teach you how to speak English effortlessly and fluently. And this won't take too long to learn the ropes. All right, guys, now we are getting to the end of this lesson. But if you think you still need more explanations, more details, more definitions, please watch this video again. And you can also Google the expressions and see more examples and try to come up with some examples in your life for your life like for the word hit the snack so if you face the problem in your life try to make a sentence with that so you need to activate all these expressions by using it in your own life try to think of an example in your life uh, for example i would say call the shots so i try to say and make an example by saying my mom calls the shots in my house or for the word blindsided i would say i didn't know that today i should do this this i was blindsided i didn't know my friends are getting married i was blindsided or for other expressions try to put Put it into practice and try to repeat all these expressions every day for three times if you repeat all these expressions every day for three to four times you won't forget like uh, after 10 days and you always remember the expressions and these expressions are commonly used which means that you are going to see or hear them in a lot of places and a lot of movies and 
you're going to learn it you're going to learn the ropes so thank you so much for watching me today leave your comments in the comment section below and hit the subscription button stay tuned see you soon